Hi, I'm Kelly Karnetsky, website designer with springshosting.com. Today I'm going to show you how to make a web page scroll bar. In order to create a web page scroll bar, you're, all you need is an HTML editor. Today, the editor I'm going to use is Adobe Dreamweaver. You can download a free trial from their website at adobe.com. It's available for Windows and Mac and you get a 30 day free trial. Now why do you want a scroll bar? Sometimes you don't want people scrolling all the way down the page, so you want just one page where they can scroll inside that page. If you want that, that's what we're about to show you. So step number one into doing this is we need to open up your favorite HTML editor. I'm going to use Dreamweaver. If you don't have Dreamweaver, you can download a free trial at adobe.com. So step two is we need to go ahead and put text in our document. So I'm just going to go ahead and paste some text in. So now I've got three paragraphs. And it's kind of big and scrolling right here on the page. So what we need to do is put it inside an iframe. So step three, after we've added the text, we need to go ahead and save the document. We're going to go ahead and save our document as content, just to make it easier. Now we've got our document saved. So step four, after we've saved our current document, we need to create a second document. And this second document is going to pull in the content from the first document into an iframe. So we go to File, New, and we create. Now inside the body, it's going to be very simple. We're just going to do our iframe tags. So step number five is to go ahead and create the iframe. So we do a very simple iframe, close it, and then close the iframe. Now step six, we need to define our parameters for our iframe. So we're going to give it a width of 500, a height of 300, and we need to say that it's scrolling. We also need to define where the content is going to be from. So we just select content and then step number seven, save the document. So we're going to save this as test content. Now we've got our iframe right here. So step number eight is to preview the document. So we're going to do a shortcut in Dreamweaver, which is F12. And we will bring over our document. And now you can see our scrolling text right here inside this iframe. You can go through and you can um, change up the borders on the iframe. You can also change the width or the height, but this is just the very basic parameters of creating one. I'm Kelly Karnetsky, website designer with springshosting.com, and you just learned how to create a web page scroll bar.